Hello everybody, today I'm going to give you a hashtag throwback first day video. Now, when I say a hashtag throwback first day video, I mean a video from my past that I've never actually shown before, or something else related to my past that generally fits in with the theme of hashtag throwback first day. Anyway, today I'm going to give you a video that I have never actually uploaded before. It's about the time I went to a place called Langish Forest. It's in an area that's become associated with Hercules the Bear. He became famous because he escaped there while filming an advert in 1980. Famous all around the world, in fact. His owners looked after him in, cent in Perthshire, in central Scotland, but they say he essentially belongs to the islands. And in fact, last week, they went along to a special gathering to remember him. I believe Hercules' body has also been reburied in that forest, and there's even a special plaque to commemorate him now. And so... I thought, what better opportunity to share the video of the time that I went to that very forest. I know it's not my best piece of work ever, but um, nonetheless, I hope you like. Hi guys, so today I'm here at a place called Langish Forest, which is quite an unusual place for us because it's full of trees. If you're wondering what's so unusual about that, then the thing is, although we live in a rural area, there aren't really a lot of trees to go around, as you can no doubt see. A few years ago we went on a school trip to this forest and at the end of it we planted some trees in this area here. So one of those trees was planted by me. Don't ask me which one, I've absolutely no idea. But they're coming along quite nicely. I'm really pleased with that actually. It is a beautiful day today, really sunny. I wouldn't get used to that if I were you though. Um, <laughs> the thing is, I don't know a lot about nature, but this is a great place to go to get away from the real world. Really peaceful and, oh my God, look at that view. Isn't it beautiful? Just love looking at the water and the sky above. It's very cloudy. There's some blue sky for you. There's the sun. Ah! He's gone blind. Never mind, let's move on. I know that since that school trip there have been a few changes made to this forest. First of which being the introduction of stamps. Look at these boxes where you can find these stamps. You stick on a piece of paper or something like that. I'm not too sure what you do with them. <laughs> you do something interesting with them, I think. And also, uh, as part of the school trip, we got some twigs that sticks together and put them roughly here to make some kind of artistic display. We call it art, but I'm not actually sure if it really was. In any case, it looked, it looked kind of cool, but unfortunately, as you can see, nature took its course. And, uh, unfortunately, nature took its course and the sticks are all gone, just been blown out of the way. So there's sorts of pathways you can go down this place and you can go off the stony path and go your own way through the forest. Take your own dangerous way if you like. You could just go down this bit where you used to be able to. Don't think it's possible anymore because of those trees in the way. Oh well, never mind. And the thing is there's also all sorts of pathways that you can go down here and I know that's been changed as well because when we went on the school trip the pathway ended roughly here now, where I'm walking to now. But now, there are two different ways you can go. There's one new path going out to the left and there's one new path going out to the right. And I think we are going to take the one that goes up to the right. Because there's a nice statue there, as you're about to see. And here he is himself, Hercules the bear. Not a real bear, obviously, it's a wooden statue, but... You know how you have different 80s icons like Madonna and Michael Jackson? Well, here, we have Hercules. Basically, the story goes that in 1980, Hercules was taken here, around here, to be filmed for an advert. And he managed to break free from his lead, I think it was, and he went off into the water between here and the mainland. So they had to do a big search for him, and this went on for weeks and apparently made international news. But they found him. They found him alive, and he starred in a James Bond film, apparently. So basically, if Hercules had been around today, if he'd escaped today, he would probably be a meme right now. Unfortunately, he died in 2001, but nonetheless, it is a story that 
people like to tell about this place, you know, the day the great bear escaped. It's a pretty good story, actually. Locally, it seems kind of cool. Do you not think so? So if you go down the left pathway, as I am now, then you'll find there's not that much to see, but it's quite intriguing because you come to another two-way here. There's quite a few of these posts around, by the way. Look out for them. So you could choose to go left, and that will take you past some wooden hut. You could go right down that way. Now this is an intriguing path because if you, if you go down here you'll have absolutely no idea what's coming. Which is quite mysterious, seems to be nothing along it, so it makes you think, oh what's going to be here? And then you look and you're confronted with this gate straight ahead of you, or to your right, absolutely nothing. It's just a space to stand in and maybe take a picture. There used to be a bench here, I remember. It's not there anymore, it's quite strange, but hey look! Get another stamp from the box. Isn't that great? And in the middle of all this, there's actually a wooden hut, which I'm in now, and there's a couple of benches in there where you can sit down and relax and look out of the windows. They're a bit steamed up today. But there are these notices which tell you the story about Hercules the bear and give you a nice little map, show you how the construction of the forest pathway has progressed. It's it's better now than it was when I was on the school trip, and I thought it was pretty impressive as it was, so... It's a pretty cool place, this is. It's really... It's a great place to go to get away from the real world. If you see what I mean.